What's up, what's up everybody? Today we're gonna do a video, finally, 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 on chilling. Chilling like a damn villain. I am so excited to finally be able to use him. All right, so let's see what chilling does. Uh, first skill, attacks three times each hit having a 30% chance to decrease target's attack speed for two turns. Okay, decrease target's attack speed. Second, increases attack speed and crit rate of all allies for two turns. I can see this being a very nice combo with uh, uh, Theo Mars. Can you? I can. Uh, but it could also be a good combo with, uh, with Spectra. Means we're going to definitely... Uh, Definitely do some damage with um, with his second skill. Actually, I don't have high crit damage on Spectre anyway, so it really doesn't matter too much. And then we have the Cunning, which sounds like an emo band. <laughs> the Cunning. Uh, still has a beneficial effect from the enemy target. When landing an attack, your attack speed increases according to the beneficially beneficial effects currently on you. So you want him to get lots of turns. He's going to steal those effects every time. So, very nice. And we have increased accuracy of ally monsters in dungeons by 40%. So, we have Bella's gonna do debuffs, Chilling's gonna do debuffs, Veramos is gonna do debuffs, Spectre's gonna do debuffs, and Bernard's gonna do debuffs. And yes, I'm using Bernard in here. I know, right? So, accuracy is very good in here. Let's make this happen. Please don't crash. Please don't crash, Summoner's War. Please don't crash. Seriously, I'd be so bummed because then I'm gonna have to wait a whole day to use this monster again. All right, yay! So we're gonna auto this. We're gonna see what happens. Oh, good job not using your third skill, Bernard. Oh my god. Okay, so kind of overkill to the special special assault's not doing that much damage, damn. Like I said, though. Like I said. All right. Okay, well, it's not really a nuke team anyway. It's just a team that can kind of do it. So. So I figure we always do... We do Vertiheal a lot, right? When we're, when we're doing uh, Spotlights and Dragons B10. So, okay, so we did see... We, we just saw a Violent proc, right? So he's on Violent. Those little... Those ghostly, ghouly blobby things. Those things, yeah. It's weird. It looks very strange. Alright, body slam, special assault. And increase all that stuff. Oh, we're lagging a little bit. We're not lagging, we're like hitting spiky spikes of crappiness. We are lagging. We're laggy, laggy, spiky crapness. Okay. Let's not do that. We at least debuffed Xeros' attack speed. We gotta make sure that we don't have Xeros attack on top of our defense break on any of our monsters, because that would be kind of crappy. Ooh, Shellbugs just found Bearman Dungeon. Shellbugs, where, where are you on my Asia server account? Come on. Come on. That's what I need. That's what I need. The Bearman Dungeon. So close. So close to Veramos. And they cannot get him. The damn bear man. Uh, and I'm sure when I... I'm sure like the first week of the game I fed one too. Ooh, can you gift in the game? Actually, that's not a bad idea. The thing that I'm just... I'm just reading chat. I don't know why I'm reading chat. That's not a bad idea, gifting. Oh no, wait, what, we're talking about UTIs. Great, now my guildmates are... This is what happens for reading chat. This is what happens. My guildmates start talking about UTIs. Fantastic. Alright. So, yeah, gifting would be nice if you could gift someone scrolls because it's really not trading it's just you're gifting someone scrolls or gifting someone crystals it's kind of a nice thing to do to your friends to do for your friends to do for your friends or to do to your friends to do for your friends all right so these immunity effects should not last very long 
Yep, there we go. Mm -hmm. Stop fucking texting me. Who text? Oh my god, there's more text. I can feel it. I can feel it. All right, we need to heal. We need to heal, Bella. We need to heal. We need to heal, baby. Okay, there we go. No, 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 no. Don't put the dots on. Don't put the dots on. Okay, Veromoss is going to move anyway. There we go. There we go. There we go, Big Papa. Big Papa V. And there we go. And we got the... We got the removal of the... Of the immunity plus the speed decrease. Nice. And there's more bosses that have uh, skills, too. That have skills, that have buffs, that have towers that buff them. So, okay. Okay. And, of course, Spectra bites the dust. Of course. Spectra basically kills himself, though. So... Nice. Let's see what we get. We get best rune ever. Okay. So we will return. We will go to Communite. And we will go to... Uh, let's see. Where are you? Where are you, Farty? Fartune. Fartune. There we go. So we'll see how he's got... I saw Violent, right? We saw Violent runes on, uh, on Chillin. I believe so. All right, 177 speed. Really not the... Uh... Okay, so he's got what? Speed, crit rate, speed, crit rate, attack. Is what I'm going to guess. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Crit rate's pretty high. And he doesn't have crit rate increase when he's uh, awakened. So he ne he's got attack on one slot. He's got he's got to have speed on another slot. So speed crit rate attack. Speed with attack resistance, okay. And then crit rate, okay. And then attack. I think these are just whatever he had lying around because I think this is uh chilling is one of his newer monsters. So resistance attack speed and crit rate speed accuracy resistance and speed here. Ooh. Nice speed on that, and attack, and crit damage, and crit rate on here. Okay. And what kind of skills do we have? Nothing on Trickster, nothing on... Okay, so actually, he only takes seven skill-ups total to max him out. Wow. Hmm. Seven skill-ups total. All right, guys. Well, this is, uh... This is the Chillin. That's Chillin's runes. Uh, I think that he could be pretty flexible with the runes, though. Uh, he could be swift. And with his skill, with his with his passive, your attack speed increases according to the number... Well... Hmm... You could do swift, though. Give him more... Basically, what that would do is to give him chances to remove the buffs in different in more different situations because the 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 what's going on in the in the battle is different more it makes sense in my head it makes sense in my head and of course who knows what the hell's going on in my head but i think swift could work basically i think violent works good as well um despair he's only a single target attacker so he really doesn't need despair um if you're using him with a leader skill, he really doesn't need too much accuracy. How much accuracy is here? 7%. Thank God we used the leader skill, otherwise we'd be dead. Oh, damn. So, thankfully we had the leader skill. I think he needs some more, uh, some more accuracy, though. He, only for his passive and his, uh, first skill. So we only need it for removing the beneficial effects, and we need it for slowing him down. But, but that is chillin'. We got to finally take a look at him in action. <laughs> He's so goofy. You're so goofy, chillin'. So goofy. All right. He looks like you guys remember Super Mario World. Some of you remember Super Mario World when you uh, like after you beat the uh, the what you call it the thing at the end, and then you change all the spoiler alert for Super Mario World that was came out in like the nineties. <laughs> After you beat the game and you beat the special world, you have to like get to the star world, and then you have to get to like the special world, and then beat all of those stages. 
I think you have to beat them all twice, too. There's two different ways I think you have to beat them twice. You don't have to beat them twice. There's a fake way to beat it, and then there's the real way to beat it. But... Anyway, he looks like one of the things that the, all the monsters change after you beat the special world. Like, all the assets in the game change, and the game looks totally different. And, uh, this is, he reminds me kind of of, uh, of one of those monsters. Oh my god, alright, fine, we're done. We're done with this video. Go home. Go home, Jew Bagel. you're going crazy again. What else is new? Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you, <laughs> as always, in the next video.